हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल प्रेस द सब्सक्राइब बटन लाइक दिस एंड देन यू हैव टू टैप द बेल आइकन एडिसन टू द सब्सक्राइब बटन लाइक दिस एंड देन यू विल गेट द नोटिफिकेशन फ्रॉम माय चैनल हेलो गाइस एंड वेलकम बैक इन दिस वीडियो आई वुड बी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू ड्रैग एंड लिफ्ट एंड वॉट इज ड्रैग एंड वॉट इज लिफ्ट एंड हाउ दिस फिनोमिना वर्क Now, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe my channel by pressing the red subscribe button below. Do follow me on Facebook, Google, Google Plus, and Twitter. All the links are given in the description below. If you have any doubt, suggestion, feedback, please mention in the comment section. And do watch my other videos also. Now, there are two phenomena: drag and lift. When a fluid, when a body move in a flowing fluid, or when a body move in free stream or when a body move in stationary fluid or when a body is stationary or the fluid is moving any case there are two forces that act these are termed as drag and lift the drag force it it opposes the motion that is if a body tries to move so drag force will be against it to oppose its motion to retard it that is known as drag force and lift force lift force is created because of the pressure difference now a common very uh, highly useful designed um, designed device is aerofoil in any aircraft the wings are made of aerofoil shape because this was researched and this design is the best design to obtain maximum lift force till date only airfoil design is used now what is uh, happening in airfoil that when the free stream velocity it encounters the surface the particle retarded but because here it is smooth so velocity will be high as comparison to velocity downward because here retardation is more so from here to here the particle velocity is low now from bernoulli's equation we know that uh, if pressure head rises velocity head decreases and if velocity head decreases pressure head rises similarly here because there is no more obstruction so velocity is high and hence the pressure will be low and here the obstruction is very large so velocity will be low and pressure will be high now pressure will be high from down to up and pre uh, pressure will be low from top to bottom so the net pressure will be acting from bottom to top so the pressure into the wing area that is the area on which the pressure acts into the pressure that will give the drag force now drag force the formula of drag force is rho u into circulation drag force is rho into u into circulation now rho is the density of the flowing fluid u is the free stream velocity and rho is the and gamma is the circulation that is vorticity into area and it is given as the line integral of the velocity v dot ds all right so this was the this was a requested video and uh, i hope now i have made myself clear on topic drag and lift so the drag force we try to minimize and lift force we try to maximize and uh, by this phenomena only all the aircrafts and uh, helicopter or anything which can fly even the birds they have also the wing in shape of aerofoil so this was the funda regarding drag and lift if you have any doubt please mention in the comment section do watch my other videos also many of the links are given in the description below and uh, some of the links are appearing on your screen right now do share this video if you have found this video helpful please press the like button till next time take care bye bye